chest hurts, like in this area. Uh, welcome to the bodybuilding.com 200k transformation challenge. <laughs> God. You're gonna make mine suck now. <laughs> All right, we'll restart. We'll restart. I'm Nick Dotson. I work at bodybuilding.com. I run the email marketing channel. So if you ever get an awesome email from us, I'm one of the guys behind it. We have an awesome team. Uh, it's a really cool company to work for. Um, every day is a every day is a new adventure. It's it's definitely been an interesting uh, few years. I've been with the company for a long time, um, about five years. Uh, this is not my first transformation. I've definitely done this before, so I kind of know what I'm I'm doing. I uh, <clears throat> been pretty active my entire life. Um, as a kid, I was an athlete. I played sports from the time I could dribble a basketball all the way through high school, even a little bit of college. So <clears throat> I'm, you know, I'm very active. Uh, I was really, I was really looking to hit the ground running with this transformation. Uh, I was pretty excited about it until a little over a week ago, I went snowboarding. It was the day after Christmas and I ended up taking a spill and breaking my right collarbone. Um, if I, uh, if I took my shirt off now, it would be a disaster in this area. It's all yellow and bruised. Got one bone going this way, one going the other way. It's just a mess. <clears throat> but um, the good news is that it was a clean break. Um, I won't be able to really hit this transformation as hard as I was hoping to. Um, I talked to my doctor probably about four to six weeks away from being able to work out consistently, but I'm probably about two and a half to three months away from from um, really getting back to where I was. So this transformation for me is going to be more about getting healthy and, and maintaining the level of progress that I've been able to gain over the course of the last year or so. Um, always been, always been pretty active in the gym. So, um, you know, I'm going to start this in pretty decent shape. My goal is to maintain that over the course of recovering from an injury. You're probably hearing my dog run around right now, and it's because my girlfriend <laughs> didn't put him in the kennel or, or help me out in any way with that. Charlie, come here. <laughs> Charlie, I'll, introdu I'll introduce you to my dog really quick. Come here, buddy. Come here. pick him up with the other arm but it's broken this is my little guy you probably recognize him if you watch my girlfriend's video uh, she's actually doing this transformation with me uh, she's Camille Ishiyama uh, she's a sweetheart I love her to death um, this is our dog together um, he's a real good he's gonna guy. be a big part of my transformation too um, maybe taking this guy for walks every so often since I can't hit the gym and lift weights as hard as I want to probably going to do a lot more cardio, uh, things like that. Uh, can't do a lot of upper body stuff yet. Maybe I'll be able to, probably be able to lift legs in the next couple of weeks, but that's going to be about it. As far as upper body goes, it's going to be off limits. Uh, so that's going to be my goal for the transformation. Um, you know, it's beyond that, uh, it's, that's where it gets tricky. I think the first 12 weeks is is really just a it's it's a starting point um everything you do beyond that <clears throat> is way more difficult so so when i end this it, for me it more just begins as i've done transformations in the past i've learned that you know at 12 weeks kind of creates a finish line once you pass that finish line you feel like you're done and for me, that's always been the case. I finish a 12-week transformation and I, I fall off quite a bit. And that's going to be my goal is for this transformation, get healthy, <clears throat> maintain my progress, and push forward beyond it. That's going to be, it's going to be my big focus. Um, anything else I need to cover? It's pretty awesome so far though, right? It feels like it's really good. I got the dog in there, I got you in there. All right, 
I think we're done. So thank you for taking the time to watch my video. You can follow me on YouTube. Um, you follow me on Instagram. Well, maybe you shouldn't follow me on Instagram. <laughs> if you want to, it's at dot sanity. Um, <clears throat> I'll try and uh, post as many videos and tips and other things as I can. I'm not certified or, or anything, but I have a general idea of what I'm doing and been doing uh, been doing this a long time. So feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions, tips, advice, or anything. Thanks for your time.